Hi, I'm Satish Patel and I'll be guiding you through your screencast recording. I've also got a, a free account here and I'm now going to go ahead and click on Start Recorder. And in a second, the recorder will launch and I have to adjust it for size. And you can simply adjust this for the area that you want to record for your presentation. And you can choose screen, you can have webcam, or both. In my, in my case, I'm just going to use screen, but you could as easily do this. All right. And I'm going to go ahead and click on record. Gives me a countdown. And then I'll say some things about the different things. So I'll start you off with a Satish Patel is a very common name, so you know there are a lot of Satish Patels around in the world, but this one's me. And this one's maybe a more recent picture of me. It's kind of strange to Google yourself, you know, you see a lot of yourself. What more can I say? Yeah, I'm going to go to the high coast, and this is a beautiful area of Sweden. I'm going to be there this weekend. If you haven't been there, I'd recommend a visit. And then I'm going to go back to... Um, screencast automatic click on pause and I'm going to go ahead and click on done and I can go ahead and uh, edit this in some way you know take out bits and pieces you can work that out about how you go about doing that you know you've got these tools and uh, you probably just want basic cut and copy and stuff and then it's done and then I'm going to save it as a video file, or actually what I'm going to do is upload it to Screencast-O-Matic. If I save it as a video file, I can then upload it to YouTube or Vimeo. The easiest thing is simply to upload to Screencast-O-Matic, which I'll go ahead and do. Uh, the name, I should change it. And I'll call this uh, Satish, and perhaps I'll give it the title, an intro, for example. And uh, go ahead and click on Publish. It'll now upload it and then I'm going to copy the link and OK. So that's pretty much all you need to do. I'm now going to go into the Moodle site and I'm logged in as a student here as you can see. I'll go into the Renaissance Sonnet Forum and click on Add a New Discussion Topic and here I'll write, I'm not quite sure what your tutor wants you to do, but um, I'll write my name and um, my topic. And here I'm going to go ahead and uh, say a few things. You can open up the menu to see more options here, colored text and stuff like that that you might want, I'm not sure. And here I'll write um, yeah, some choice words in my gobbledygook's language and my presentation and I'm going to mark that text. Now you can see what happens, you can see this button here it's grayed out, but when I mark the text here I can click on this and I'm going to now paste in that link and I can open in this window or I'm going to open in a new window. It just means that if I open a new window, a new tab opens as opposed to this being in front of Moodle and you have to, if you want to go back to Moodle, you have to kind of like backtrack. And I'm going to click on insert and then post forum. There you go. I'm going to click on search my topic now. And as you can see, if we can now click on my presentation, then that will take us into Screencast-O-Matic and there's the video which I recorded earlier on. Okay, so that's the whole phase. Um, I think it's pretty easy. I'd like to think that it is. Good luck with the task.